pastoral way of life is severely threatened. There isn't enough grazing land for the livestock. And this land cannot give them any more because it is depleted. Cooking energy, millions of trucks and transport crisscrossing the land, channeling water from the grasslands to the sea, washing the topsoil. The cycle of the land feeding the livestock, the livestock feeding the pastoralists is broken. The sustainability and success of pastoralist communities depends almost entirely on the state of their surrounding environment. For centuries, families have survived and thrived as nomads in the Horn of Africa. Every year, Somali pastoralists have traveled with their livestock from the coast to the highlands and back in search of grazing lands. But over the last few decades, Multiple natural and man-made shocks have depleted pasture conditions. Over time, forests and pastures have turned into desert, and some regions are faced by a severe environmental crisis. At the same time, the populations of the region lack both the human and financial resources to address these critical issues. Preserving pasture in the Horn of Africa highlands is about more than just saving the environment. It's about protecting the traditional backbone of the regional economy and society. إن حولها إن هل كانوا دام توي شو يعني هل يعني كله؟ مركب مركب نسوي كله وجاهدو إن حوله نقول كان هل كان سو ودان هل كان يلا خرجيا. When Somali herders migrate, the camel is their transport, their capital, and their provider of meat, milk, ghee, and everything that can be traded for it. The animals are so valuable that Somalis do not traditionally ride on them, but walk side by side over long distances. The loss of a herd is enough to permanently change a community. Despite rapid desertification and the challenges pastoral families face, people are still finding ways to slow down and potentially reverse the environmental damage. Working with pastoralists and community leaders, Adesso has been putting in place small but significant interventions that go beyond feeding hungry families. As such, we work with communities to put in place low technology interventions that focus on restoring the pasture which is vital for the regional economy. Simple interventions, like using rocks to build a wall, can help prevent erosion of the land during the rainy season. Meanwhile, broader measures such as slowing the charcoal trade and teaching people about using alternative fuels can also lead to long-lasting changes. Now what it needs is the pastoralists to be helped to learn and to internalize and to collectively take care of their land so their land can feed their livestock and the livestock can feed them. That will take money and skills and continuity. As with all our programs, we focus on finding long-term solutions and have devoted much attention to working with pastoral youth to offer them an education that is relevant to their needs. Over time, we have seen improvements in the land and we've seen people take responsibility for their surrounding environment. Decades of environmental damage have endangered a traditional Somali way of life. Adesso remains committed to spreading environmental awareness and pushing for positive change at the local level to ensure that pastoralism has a place in the Somalia of tomorrow. Somalia can come back. 
there is time to save it and rehabilitate it. Oh, hey, oh.